If you were a four-dimensional creature, you could see through the walls in front of you right now. Let me explain with an example. So let's say that we have these two people, Josh and Molly, and they both exist in the second dimension. Can Josh currently see Molly from where he is standing right now? The simple answer is no, and the reason why is because there's a wall currently in front of Josh obstructing his view. Now I'll ask you the same question about Molly. Can Molly currently see Josh from where she is standing? And the answer for Molly is also no, because these two-dimensional creatures have their view obstructed by this wall between them. But then this begs the question, how come we can see both of them right now? Well, the reason why is because we are three-dimensional creatures looking at a two-dimensional world. So not only can we see Josh and Molly, but we can also see the thickness of the wall that separates Josh and Molly. So hypothetically, this logic also applies to the fourth dimension. If a four-dimensional creature were to look at our three-dimensional world, they would be able to see through our three-dimensional walls. Not only that, but they could also see the inner dimensions of the wall, including the thickness and the height of the wall inside, which in my opinion is quite hard to even comprehend.